and I am back with another video and today as you already see by the title it is vlogmas day 11 I ain't gonna lie I feel like every creator goes through this phase of vlogmas when they're trying to complete the whole thing of just feeling exhaustion and tiredness literally posting 25 videos in a month is crazy okay how many break that up? that's literally 25 divided by four is 6.2 that's like saying you post six times out of the week out of the regular week it's seven days in a week so that's like saying you post every day except for one we're almost finished i'm trying to get through it it's a whole lot of whole lot of but we're still gonna get through that's all that matters a sneaker head or anything but i do pick up items that I really really like rambling if you're new to my channel go ahead and hit the subscribe button and also turn the bell post notifications so you're notified every time I post a video and if you're returning welcome back and yeah let's go ahead and get into the video you can see behind me I kind of have some type of organization going already so up here are my ones down here are my fours slash red and black shoes these are my row of dunks these are my designer sneakers. These are miscellaneous. I got Jordans, Vitas, Converse. And then the bottom row is all Jordans. So I'm just gonna go in order, take one down from each row. And that's how we are gonna do this. Jordan Retro Ones. And these are the Tokyo Biohacks. I really, really like these shoes. My next shoe are these blue ones. I don't know what these are called. I think these are called like UNC Carolina ones or something, I don't know. But these are a kid size five, I believe. And I ordered these off of Go or Stock Kicks. So I have not bought a pair of shoes for retail in forever. At this point, I just think it's a thing of the past because you will never you will never find like a retro retro, like a hot retro for full pro, like retail price in the store. Like it just is not happening. The next pair of shoes, and y'all, these are literally my favorite pair of shoes out of any of the shoes I own is the fearless ones oh so so pretty like I just like a patent leather shoe simple orange black orange bottom real cute put it on with something could put the orange shoe strings in the white shoe strings in it's not one of my favorites but this is definitely a shoe that I'll put on and it's the Concord y'all and I've been holding on to these for a while I have these shoes for like three Three or four years I want to find somebody who restores sneakers because i have like a lot of shoes like my cements i want all of those restored I have these carmines these released again just a simple red and white shoe everybody's favorite shoes are the bread 11s i feel like this is a timeless shoe like you can never go wrong with getting you a pair of bread ones bread 11s bread fours it's just the bread like it's the colorway of jordan baby bread fours and this is the OGs. I love a sneaker with Nike Air on the back. It just do something different. Lightning Force. And this is honestly, I'm not going to lie y'all. This is not something that I would have just bought. Like if I would have just seen that they were releasing. And I really, really like to have my Cement Force. These are one of the shoes that I want to get restored. And it's an OG. You know, got the Nike Air on the back. This is a classic. Um, blue and gray you can't go wrong like and i don't even wear these shoes that much i honestly forget i have these shoes and i really need to start wearing them more legend blue 11 lows a lot of people have beef with lows and i think these these released they released this year sometime i don't remember so the next couple of shoes are just gonna be more so like collector collectible shoes that i don't want to give away but i just have to have like 
one of them is in pristine condition and I've probably worn them like three times. These are called, I think they're just the Carolina Blue 11 Lows. One of my favorite shoes. I love the color. I love that it's just white and blue. I got in y'all, this shoe is so beat up. Is this True Blue 3. I don't even much like threes like this, but this is literally a classic. And you say red, white, and blue all together. No, this shoe is so pretty. When it was brand new, this was like one of my favorite pair of shoes. It's like the red velvet. I guess it's called the red velvet 11. This is just a beautiful shoe, but you can only wear it in the winter. Gold lace tips, gold accents. Like this was just a quality shoe all around. Next shoe is this Laney uh, 5. And this isn't like the original ladies. The original ladies are all white. These released my senior year, like February or March, are these. And these are, the, both of these shoes are like damn near brand new. Like, I barely wore these. This is one of my favorites. This is in my top five. This is so different. Like I haven't, I haven't seen a shoe like this. So it's just like, it's like this red, almost infrared, but more red type of red. Then it's like this army green and it has like camo detailing. It's not gonna focus. Oh dang, I forgot I had these y'all. These are one of my favorite shoes too, but I don't really like them no more because I got a bunch of pink shoes. But it's these 12s. I really forgot I had these. First off, we have the Sunset Pulse Dunks. Very different colorway. Shoes are different. It's one of those type of situations. I think they're called like Camo Cell Dunk or something like that. And this is the Off-White UNC Dunk. The fact that people slept so hard on these that I purchased these for like, I think I purchased these for like three something. And you know, Off-White is usually like the overhyped shoe. Like anything Off-White collab usually is kind of higher. So when I seen these, I was like, damn, that is a cute shoe. Like the silver, it just looks so like robotic. I don't know what it is about it, but this is a really, really pretty shoe. We have is this RKO Brown Dunk. And I think these are called the Pink Foams, but it's just this burgundy and pink. Focus. Real cute, real cute. Anything pink. Say it for me, I'ma buy it. These are the Pink Velvet dunks and the burgundy on this shoe is more closer to red let me show y'all it's more closer to red and also the pinks are different like this is more of like a like a millennial pink and like it has like a rose gold check and this is more of a baby pink and it has a burgundy check so these are two different shoes two completely different looks and you just know if it's pink, I'ma buy it. Thing that I regret purchasing are Alexander McQueen's. Oh my God, these are so dirty. Let me pick a different one up. These shoes is not all that to be doing all that because these shoes are so freaking uncomfortable, y'all. I got these for Christmas last year and they're so uncomfortable. Like this, the shoe as a, as a whole, I hate like these are my only pair of all white shoes so when i have like when i'm in a crunch and i have to find a shoe to match with something and i have to put these on they hurt so bad one of my favorite shoes like to date um just because i love everything about it y'all see like really really cute the only thing i'm mad about is not this one one of these the one of the tags were peeling though you shouldn't for a 900 dollar pair of shoes I shouldn't be gluing shit back down on the shoe. The next shoe, and this is one of my favorites. I look at it like a little Pepto-Bismol shoe. I've been wanting these shoes for the longest, but I could not break myself down to purchase it until my birthday this year. So these are the Balenciaga Track um, sneakers, and it's just in the color pink. I buy any shoe pink. We know this. My last little designer sneaker are this Gucci... I don't know what they call, but I just love this shoe. It's really, really pretty. It has little details. All the little mismatch fabrics, like the white fabric has like little small GG. The navy blue has little small GG. And then the light pink outline. I don't know, I just think this shoe is crafted to perfection. Yeezy Azareth. Um, I think these are Yeezy. 
I don't know. I don't know the Yeezy numbers. This is a really cute shoe. This is one of my favorite favorite Yeezys that have released. Converse. A lot of people ask me where I got these. I got these off of Essence. I literally bought the last size. Y'all always ask me where I got them from, but I haven't seen them since then. Like, Dee Dee sent them to me, and she was like, these are you. Because she seen them on a girl, and she was like, yeah, these are literally you. And I was like, hell yeah. So I went and found them, and luckily I found them on Essence in one, like, my size, the last size. So I ordered them. I haven't seen them since. Like, I've been trying to find them for y'all because y'all asked me, like, this is probably one of the most shoes that y'all asked me where I've gotten it from. And I can't tell y'all because I don't see it. These are the Como Des, Cargon, whatever you say it, CDG, whatever. Um, Converse. Personally, I got these for my birthday. I really like the style of the shoe, but I wish I would have went a size down because what size are these? They're women's seven, but I feel like Converse have always ran big. So for the last shoe today. We just have these Converse. They got the look. So I really like this more than regular Converse because I like a little platform shoe sometimes. But yeah, I really love these. Not too much to say about it. It's a classic black and white shoe. <sighs> but that is all the shoes I have for y'all today. Um, I am going to get some more shoes during Christmas and all of that. So in next year's sneaker haul or sneaker collection video it will be updated i might have i might not have some of this stuff i might have more stuff and this who knows but yeah that's all the sneakers i got for y'all today it was real real chill i had to get a little pre-record out for y'all because i have a whole bunch of whole bunch of stuff going on and coming up so i hope you guys enjoyed this video can y'all see it in my eyes that i'm tired because i'm fighting for my life okay Hope you all enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, subscribe. Also turn about post notifications so you can be notified every time I post a video. And yes, I will see you guys in the next one.